To begin preparing the reducer for installation, start by cleaning the support side bore, tapered cone, and the flange cone of the assembly. Remove any residue with a shop towel or soft cloth. Do not use any type of solvent during the cleaning process. KL, K1, and KSS1 units do not have a tapered cone as the taper is machined into the hollow bore. Insert the tapered cone into the bushing bore, noting the position of the cone slot. When installing the flange cone assembly, rotate the flange slot 90 degrees in relation to the tapered cone slot. Insert two bushing bolts loosely into the bushing to hold it in place. The two socket head spacer bolts are to remain in the bushing until the drive is positioned onto the shaft and the bushing bolts are ready to be tightened. Install the remaining bushing bolts into the support ring, threading them loosely. The complete support side bushing assembly should have all the hex head bushing bolts and the two socket head spacer bolts. Start assembling the clamp side by cleaning the bore of the reducer, tapered cone and flange cone assembly. Remove any residue with a shop towel or soft cloth. Do not use any type of solvent during the cleaning process. KL, K1, and KSS1 units do not have a tapered cone as the taper is machined into the hollow bore. Insert the tapered cone into the bushing bore and note the position of the cone slot. When installing the flange cone assembly, rotate the flange slot 90 degrees in relation to the tapered cone slot. Insert two bushing bolts loosely into the bushing to hold it in place. The two socket head spacer bolts are to remain in the bushing. Install the remaining bushing bolts into the clamp ring, threading them loosely. The purpose of the socket head spacer bolts is to maintain a space between the bushing rings and to keep the bushing from binding as the reducer is slid onto the shaft. Please use the dimensions referenced on the installation sheet provided with the bushing kit. With the bushing kit installed, the reducer is ready to be mounted on the shaft. Stober, geared to a higher standard.